Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Uncle Jesse. We're going to go ahead and do our 2021 Allen Ginter Baseball 4-Box PYT number 7. All right. I'm looking right now. It looks like a trade might have happened. I'm trying to understand what's going on. Trade Padres for Braves. Trey says, of course. So Padres for Braves is the trade? Am I understanding that correctly? Padres for Braves. All right, so I guess that's the trade. Padres to Trey. Braves to Richard. Any other trades? It right, looks like uh, that's uh, it for the trades. Alright, we're going to go Six times in the random. This is for the non baseball spot. All right. Going, uh, another trade Marlins for Giants. Is that another trade? So Marlins to Freak, uh, Giants to Steven, and we're still sending so Freak sending his base cards. To uh, J. Messes. <laughs> Alright, let me make it over there. Zima's going to have a party with all those cards. Uh, Alright, anyways, random. Still haven't done the team uh, for the non-baseball spot. Uh, good luck, everyone. Here we go. And the money shot. Six. Boom, six. Uh, congrats to Yang. Who straight up one shot at the non baseball spot? All right, now I do want you guys to uh, pay attention to one thing here. I did make a change to this break and all following breaks. All right, group break checklist has Uncle Larry going to the other. Uh, non-baseball spot, which is incorrect. Beckett 
has all Uncle Larry cards going to the Phillies. And that makes 100% sense considering it's Andrew McCutcheon and he's in a Phillies uniform. Alright? It's also in the description. Uncle Larry goes to the Phillies. No exceptions. Alright? Group, like I said, group break checklist has Uncle Larry going to the non-baseball spot. That was an error. Beckett has Uncle Larry going to the Phillies, which I think is correct. So, I'm going to honor the non-baseball, the Uncle Larry to the non-baseball spot for PYTs 1 through 6. Moving forward from 7 on, any PYTs I do, Uncle Larry will go to the Phillies. All right? Just trying to clear that up there. That was a bit of a uh, topic not too long ago. See what we got here. Alright, so I'm gonna pick a box from the top and kind of work my way down. That way I have a box from the top, the middle, and the bottom. Choose you. Thank you. Alrighty. As always, good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Thank you, Isaac. Just do a little maneuver here. Boom. Carol's are you gonna tell me how magical it was? And how you felt like a kid again and you fell in love with the game all over again and blah blah blah. Steven, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, looks like a frame mini here. I hope it's a big hit. Number three of ten. Okay, uh, well, I mean, it's cool for the kid, you know. Got his own card. Kind of jealous. Going to the non-baseball spot, Leo Kelly, who's a, apparently a social media star. Signed it, Leo. Well, there you go. Yep, that's indeed who he is. He he reviews Shirley Temples. On his Instagram page. That's the world we live in now. <laughs> and as he gets old, right. As he gets older, watch him do the progression from Shirley Temples. To like margaritas. To like natural light is going to be hilarious.
Come on. Got a relic for Trevor Story of the Rockies. <laughs> what, Javis? <laughs> what? Leo Kelly caught, you know, driving under the influence of Shirley Temples or something? Someone forgot the cherry and he stabs a guy. <laughs> uh, I asked for a Shirley Temple. Smacks the guy with a glass. Maiders him. Goes on the run. The very thing that made him famous. Now he's an outlaw. On the USA's Most Wanted, the story of Leo Kelly, based on a true story. And what do we have here? A Guerrero, Vladimir Guerrero Sr. relic. Mini frame, main uh, frame mini relic. At that, very nice. Expos are national, so that goes to the nationals. Put that in team order the list so it's easier to see. Oh, preseason football. In like three weeks, the regular season begins. And uh, I think I'm going to do fantasy football this year. <laughs> Very true, Trey. Very true. Very true. You guys ever watch a movie called uh, Idiocracy? Hilarious movie. And, uh... Kind of, kind of crazy how... We're leaning towards, you know, <laughs> what that movie's all about. You can actually watch it on YouTube for free, matter of fact.
can't talk baiting. <laughs> ah, dude, that movie is classic. Fucking the president's name is uh, Rancho Cuco. Like he's all the. <laughs> He's a wrestler. He looks absolutely ridiculous. And they give the plants freaking Gatorade. <laughs> or what the equivalent of Gatorade is. Because it's got electrolytes. It really is a great movie. Like, I highly suggest anyone watch it if you want a good laugh. Can't tell I'm breaking. Box number two. Roy Wood Jr. with the relic. Go to the baseball spot. Yes, JMS. Well, it's not actually like it's not like literally Gatorade, but it's the equivalent of it because it's got electrolytes. It has its own name. I forget what it's called. Last quarterback with an ankle injury there. Boyle. I got the Bills Lions game on right now. I think there's another game going on right now too. And another game like at eleven. Oh, Cardinals Cowboys later tonight. Nice. Dolphins Bears tomorrow at one o'clock. popular guy, you know, it's got to be tough to be that popular. No, I'm on number box two. Oh, wait, what? I'm on uh, box number two. (laughs) 
Come on. Richard sipping on that crown. Is that one of the crown apple or one of those uh, flavored uh, abominations? What do we have here? Mr. Castillo of the Reds with the frame mini autograph. Luis Castillo, there you go. Paul in the house. What's up, player from the Himalayas? Ah, <laughs> the purple bag and all. There you go. That's the way to go. Keep all sorts of things in the purple bag. You feel me? Yeah, that crown, the crown apple is disgusting. So is that crown vanilla. Chilling like a villain. With the money to the ceiling. Boom. Add, added that on there for you. And it looks like this one is hand numbered. That's why I always check the back of these minis. 18 of 25. Dave Hansen going to the non baseball spot. Sprite and Crown is a nice little combo. Are we doing a freestyle right now, Paul? Got holes in their feelings. Uh, damn, hold on. Chilling like a villain, stacking money to the ceiling. Got holes in their feelings. Damn it. You're going to have to give me some time here. There's a lot going on right now. Rich Crown Royale. That sounds super fancy. What is that? Like triple distilled or something? Oh, that's a song. There you go, Paul. You got it. You got it. I'm, 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 I, you got the juice now, Paul. You been had the juice. All right, box number three right now. Oscar Hernandez, Blue Jays Relic.
Need something nice. Frame mini relic for Nolan Arenado of the Cardinals. Sage Steel. <laughs> a redemption Sage Steel? Man, that is, that's got to be like a holy grail. Corey Seager, Relic Dodgers. It's been raining a lot lately. Oh, that's right. Isn't there like a hurricane on its way? I think I saw something on the news about that. That would explain uh, all this rain lately. Pairs, they're good for you. I'm not a big pear guy. They're not. Uh, I mean, they're 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 all right, but after a few bites, it's like okay, whatever. Shouts out to Derek Lee, helping us win that championship back in the day. <laughs> you got it, Richard. All 
box number four. What do we got? Haven't hit the box toppers yet. There's about two box toppers per case. Right, let's see what we got. Hey, it's the Chrome Hot Box. Nice. Yeah, the crumbs look super nice. Yeah, I think I opened the case this year. That only had one rip card in it. Hell, I, I opened the box that was mixing a box loader. There's supposed to be one in every box. So. Someone's slacking at their job. Don't want to point any fingers. But, uh, anyway. Kevin the Gandhi. This year's Steve Steele. Jorge Basada, Yankees Relic. Dang, Jamie. That's pretty good. Oh. Always, oh, ever present, Eric Hosmer. Padre's Relic. Almost done.
talking to me, Cheeto. I do not know who that is. I think so. Oh, a pretty mini? Nice. Ozzy Smith. Pretty mini autograph for the Cardinals. Cardinals having a good break. collectibles yeah I mean I'm probably the wrong person to ask I can't tell you the last time I walked into a hobby shop I have to do some research though, Cheeto. Maybe uh, do business together or something. Alright, let's open up these uh, toppers here. Or loaders, as they call them. Hit an autograph here. We got Freeman Braves. The Grom Max loader. Louis Robert box loader. Here comes the autograph. Come on. Got a Yeti Molina loader for the Cardinals. Fortunately, no autograph there. Alrighty, let me Alright, so check this out. Well, these are numbered by the way. We got Hosmer, Posada, Seeger, Hernandez, Hosmer, uh, Wood Jr. Story, a mini for Dave Hansen, eighteen twenty five, that's pretty cool. Also got a Larry Guerrero relic and uh, a Nolan Arenado uh, relic as well. And the good stuff, uh, Frey Miniato for Luis Castillo. We have Ozzy Smith and number seven of, I'm sorry, number three of ten. Social media darling. I guess he, he he numbered it four of ten on on the card, but it's three of ten here. That's kind of funny. Mr. Leo Kelly. Gotta go to the non baseball spot. Alright. That's the break. Thank you all. I'll get it out to you.